What's up, guys? If you are into music reaction channels that are honest, raw, and authentic, look no further. You found your destination. It is the Taz and Philly Show. Welcome to our journey. And make sure that you subscribe below and enjoy the show. <laughs> What is good, you sexy son of a gun? It is Philly. That is Taz. It is the Taz and Philly show, and we are back with another reaction video. What is good, everybody? We are back with another reaction video, and here we go. We're, we're going down a totally different rabbit hole tonight. This is what we haven't seen yet. Subscriber request. The Taz will get into momentarily. I know he wants to give a shout out. This is a band called Night Wish, and the song is called Ghost Love Score, and it is a live version. Um, like I said, it is a subscriber request. Never heard of this band. Uh, don't know a thing about them. We believe that maybe the, the lead singer is a female, but I won't even swear to that because I haven't watched one iota of this. I am going into this completely completely unbiased and raw and i know taz is as well so i don't know what the hell that was what was that um i'm just looking up the comments to see if anybody else had suggested this as well because so i'll give like two shout outs so oh, keep okay. talking all right business. <laughs> so this is a lot a live version apparently so that yes. was the specific recommendation and that is what we're going to do hopefully uh some people in the comments know a little bit about this band and if you let us know if you do if you know them, let us know if there's any other songs we should be checking out. But uh, this is going to be our first one. So hopefully the first impression's a good one. Taz, give your thoughts, give your shout out, and then we will get into it again. And it will be Night Wish, Ghost Love Score, the live version. And this will be our first uh, opportunity to listen to this band. So what do you got to say, Taz? Yes, yeah, so um, this is a special shout out. I was trying, I'm so sorry. Usually we have our list handy. Um, because I feel that somebody else had also recommended this. So if you did, I apologize, but I st we still thank you. But the one name I do remember um, is one of our subscribers, Jukebox Dave. So Jukebox, Jukebox Dave, yes. Uh, awesome, awesome individual. So you recommended Nightwish, and you said live. So um, I hope this is the right live. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> true. Nonetheless, we've never heard of Nightwish. I've never heard them play or sing or anything um and i've never heard them live so these it's like two surprises in one because i know live is such, such a different dynamic and acoustics and stuff as indoor studio so we're very excited to hear this and hope you all enjoy it if maybe this is your first time watching this like we are uh but yeah thank you jukebox dave anything else you want to say philly no i want to i want to hear it and then hopefully have some things to say afterwards all right, so here we go. <clears throat> Ooh, I like that. Yes. Nice crowd. like that. Very theatrical. Very, yeah. Orchestra like or something. Yep, definitely. Yes, okay. Okay. 
singer girl damn excuse me wow I mean, I can only imagine what it feels like being there, hearing that sound like around you and like the, the ambiance of the lights and stuff. It's, um, what's that word? It's like it's ethereal. Are you I'll kidding me, bro? Card. I'll cut this part Earn out in the middle, okay? Ah. I'll cut this part out because it won't let Got me it. skip it. R&B with Chase Freedom Unlimited. How do you cash back? Chase, make more of what's yours. Every time you feed your pet hills, you help feed a shelter pet, which helps make them healthy, happy, and more adoptable, changing their life forever. They're making me watch so this. So they can change yours. Yeah, it's because it's a fucking hour and a half Science video. Science did that. True. Thank God for editing.
like that. Yeah, I, I, I've never seen anything really quite like that before. Um, Talk about a first impression. I mean, they command a stage. And you want to know something? They probably have to perform live because with her vocal powers, if they were inside, she might shatter all the damn windows. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's wow. definitely that's definitely a, um, a wow. performance. And obviously, you're getting a lot when you go to see them. It's not just her voice or the band itself i mean they're they're putting on a show that was a spectacle she's got a very powerful voice it's like they reminded me of evanescence a little bit the lead singer of evanescence oh yeah also also like had some iron maiden qualities to me i don't know how much you know about iron maiden but just some of that like orchestra ish like just the riffs um i'm wondering if they're influenced by either of those bands or maybe both a little bit but to that being said very unique not anything like either one of them really she had a really powerful voice it was like celine dion-esque or something like where she's gonna like rip the <laughs> roof off the house um wow and 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 honestly with the way the band plays and all that shit behind oh ah, i mean that you have to have a powerful voice because you, if not you're gonna get drowned out by every fucking thing else that's going on right so that was Good a that, that was pretty wild man i mean i Never heard of them. Never seen them. Don't know why. I don't know if they're an American band. I don't know where they're from. I don't know. I don't know too much about them at all. But I'm intrigued to hear what else they got because um, I don't know, like where you go from that. Like, how, I mean, what? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I think, they, you know, they're way beyond being like the opening act. <laughs> like, just suppose they were the opening act. You're like, yeah. well, who the hell is coming out after that? Like, Jesus is he going. You know, like they were so spectacular, and you can see the crowd there. So obviously. They're popular. Um, she must be exhausted after a concert. I can't even imagine. Just the, all the fucking... And then that was, yeah, that was 10 minutes for one song. So, like, I don't know how many songs they sang at this concert. But, yeah, I mean, 
that right there like but now now picture this we're not even at the concert we're looking at it through a lens and i could still feel the atmosphere like when they had like that ethereal type music and then like the lights were like purplish blue and then there was that moment where in the middle where her, the lead singer wasn't even at the microphone but they still had this ambiance and stuff like i can only imagine how they felt out in the audience like so that means they take you on like an experience that song was like an experience not just somebody singing a song and that's what i think it should be especially when you're at a concert like it should feel like like nothing you've ever experienced in your life so for me to feel that through the damn tv screen I can only imagine how those people in the audience did. I mean, they were, well, they were already passing people around and people were like holding their face and some people were singing the words with her. So like they were really in the moment and stuff like that. So I've never been to a concert myself of that magnitude, like where there's no seats, you know, like you're just standing and there's like thousands of people there, but that must speak something about Nightwish for them to do that. So um I just uh, love that her vocal abilities was stellar. Um and then the band was on point, like they meshed together, and I just love the whole experience. That's what it was. It was ex it, a vocal, not just vocal because it wasn't just her. It was an experience, a musical experience. It wasn't just me watching a video on YouTube. It was a musical experience. So yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, it was um, it was like a, I've never really heard anything quite like them. I mean, I think they're like I said, there's a couple of those bands I compared them to as like influenced by or had sort of sort similar qualities to them, but nothing really like them at all. They're kind of in a lane all their own. So, I, I mean, yeah, it was a great suggestion. So, Dave, that was a good one, man. I you picked that one out of nowhere. I would never have probably found that if it wasn't for this. So. Now that you got us here, and maybe the you know, Night Switch fans will be rolling in here and telling us what other Night Wish. I Night apologize. Wish. Night Night Switch. Yeah, Night Wish. Ugh. I don't want to fuck this up. Night Switch. Hey, Night Switch. Night. I, I was a tongue test. I messed up. A Night tongue Wish. Tongue test. <laughs> tongue test. You see, that's what it's getting late here, man. It's twelve thirty four on the East Coast, man. It's been a long day. Night Read the banner. Night Read the banner. Well, Night Wish. Sorry, but Thank either you. way, I wish you would say it right. <laughs> I wish you would shut the fuck up and let me get my thoughts out. Night my Wish, best friend. Go ahead. Night <laughs> Night Wish. It was great, and I yes. wish you guys would give me some more uh, suggestions. So, Dave, Jukebox, Dave. Thank you. Anybody else who has known this song, or I'm assuming I said last time I said something like this, I'm going to retract because the last time I said nobody would know this song. We had a million people that knew this song. So I'm assuming that plenty of people know who this is and have heard it before. So in the comments of this particular video, let us know which next one we should react to because it looks like we're going on another journey. And I have a feeling that we're going to have, let me read the banner, Nightwish fans coming in here and pointing us in the right direction. So again, thank you guys so much. We'll get into rating it unless you have some something more you want to talk about. Otherwise, uh, we can rate it and move on no forward. i'm just the fact that i'm i'm excited like because um for anybody watching this for the first time because you just never know we do not pre-watch this we don't peek um we're not that desperate where we have to like pry and look and so we when we are recording this and we press play was our first experience if you never heard of night wish like we never heard of it i hope you watch this video give it a chance you're already on our channel give it a chance don't just look for reactions that of groups that you know check out all of our shit because uh, this was popping really loved it really a great experience so that's all i have to say so we can vote okay well we are going to vote then so anybody new to the channel it is ass or pass it's a two rating system thumbs up thumbs down either it's ass or we pass it and anybody that has uh, been here a while you guys know the drill so taz Count to three or count from three to one. Whichever you choose, we'll leave it up to you. I will drum roll, and then we will rate together. All right. You ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Yes. That's for the lead singer. That's for the band. There you go. That's for the experience. <laughs> That's for the <laughs> no, yeah. Uh, multiple Dude. thumbs up. And uh, and this this is for you, Dave. Good, good, good suggestion. 
Um, so keep them coming. Let us know in the comments section. Anybody that knows this band, what's the next one we should listen to? Is there an experience like this one? Is there a song that's entirely different? Does she have a song where she screams? Does she have a song where, I don't know. I, I mean, I don't know what to expect after that. So I guess anything that we get is going to be another new experience. So again, thank you guys so much for being here and checking this out with us. I don't think Taz has anything further you want to get into or say before we get out of here. Um, just thank you to the fans, subscribers. You've really been making us feel stoked. You've really been inspiring us to want to keep doing this. Um, for the large majority of you, you have said such wonderful, wonderful comments that keep us motivated. We really appreciate the love. We read every comment and we try very hard to respond to every comment, um, uh, even when they're growing. So yep. thank you. We could not do this without you. There would not be a Taz and Philly without all of you. Um, please like, please share, please tell people about us, um, be on this journey with us, um, and keep suggesting songs, um, and experiences for us. So, um, you know, and that's pretty much it. So thank you. Yeah. I mean, yesterday we, uh, shot our videos and we were like just at 700 subscribers. And as we're finishing these up, we're actually approaching closer to 800 subscribers. So, you know, we couldn't thank you guys enough for that. You guys have been absolutely amazing. And uh, because of that, we want to continue to keep this channel like kind of the way it's been. And you control it. Like this is why we're going into these different genres and different types of music that we've never experienced before. And we hope you guys are loving it right along with us. So um, before we get out of here, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for being here. You can be anywhere in the world that you would want to be. And you spent the last 25 minutes or so watching this with us. I am Philly. That is Taz. It is the Taz and Philly show. Thank you so much to Nightwish for bringing us a great experience. Have a great <laughs> night. Peace. And take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>